The National Association of Realtors reports home sales have been down eight of the last nine months, and there are signs the market may be at rock bottom. So how does this report reflect what's going on here in the Southwest Florida market? Here to discuss this with us this morning is Denny Grimes with Denny Grimes and team at Keller Williams Realty. Denny, good morning, and thank you for being here with us. My pleasure. Okay, so sales down eight of the last nine months. Doesn't sound good. What's causing this? Is it from the higher interest rates we're still experiencing? Yeah, interest rates are a factor. I mean, when the, the article even went on to say that the typical mortgage payment for our homeowners over the last year has gone up 54%, which is quite a, quite a chunk, right? However, add to that the rising home prices that the, the buyers had to pay over the last year, uh, the real cause of the homes uh, sales dropping is the affordability issue, and the homes are just way out of reach for more, uh, most people, and that means the prices are going to soften. Okay. And so is the Southwest Florida housing market following the same pattern that's being suggested by the NRA? Yeah, and well, AR, excuse me. That's okay. <laughs> I, I knew what you meant. So, uh, yeah, yes, in the way our, our, our sales are slowing, yet there's something interesting. So when you compare month over month, which is what NAR did, uh, Lee County sales were down about 7%. Mm -hmm. And uh, Collier had a little bump, 5%. That's not really the story. The story is this is the first time we've seen our market trend slower than our plumb line year of 2019. So sales are slowing. Forget about 20 and 21. Our sales are slowing, slower than 19. And in addition, Lee County's home sales uh, in August were slower than any other month in the last two years, except for May, which is the epicenter of COVID. Mm -hmm. And Collier, the last two months were slower than we've seen in five years. Interesting. Okay, so NAR is saying the market may be at rock bottom. What's your opinion on that? Well, they, they like to put a bow on any type of news. And mm -hmm. so based on the data they're looking at, they may be right uh, and they may not be right. I don't like false information or false hope. I don't see that in our market. Our market is still slowing, yet I don't think it's bad news because as prices soften a little bit, more people can own a home, become, become more popular, mm -hmm. and the demand increases. So uh, I think our market was due for a correction. So I don't think it's bad news at all. Okay. And so I always like to ask kind of what is your advice for people at home? who may be either selling, buying a home, kind of what's your advice for them right now? It's a pretty good time to sell. I mean, you, they, they still have a lot of house money uh, that they could make. And uh, waiting probably won't be a, a friend of a seller. I would take advantage of the market while it's still good. Okay. All right, Denny, thank you so much for joining us once again this morning. My pleasure. All right.